Now, um, this will be a great victory for the Philippine Veterans Affairs Office. When you go home, I'm sure there'll be a big ceremony, a celebration. Yes. This is a celebration for the country. So Don't you think the, so? Yeah, this is the first time, or is, oh, of course, second time, or the uh, first project that we did for for the veterans, which is very important. That and, is so and this beautiful. Will be the, the files will be stored at the Ma Mount Summit National Shrine in um, Bataan. And there will be a World War II uh, study center in that in the National Shrine in Mount Summit. And it will store these documents. And these speaking documents. of other challenges, the challenges yes. are, of course, we have a very, minimal, very minimal budget. We work, we work so in a very tight budget. Yeah, and then sometimes the physical, our allowances are delayed. And so. also the physical, the, the, what, the tire, uh, what do you call this? Yeah, the numbness um, of the our numbness, arms yeah. and the radiation of the laptop. And you also sometimes get hurt, like army. Yes, I just got a wound here <laughs> because of the fastener, so it got a spill of blood uh, earlier. And then, of course, but I'm lucky that I have an anti tetanus mm -hmm. shot. So. And also the the smell of the old paper. And uh, just uh, today, uh, it feels like you're going to have asthma because. But that's why you have to wear a mask. I see. Yeah, so you want to inhale all those dust. So last 2015, uh, one of the Filipinos, Ameri Filipino Americans here gave us, gave us an ointment uh, for ointment. our body aches because <laughs> you can just imagine from oh, 9 a.m. Yeah. to 4.30, we're scanning around 1,300 documents non-stop. Wow. So that's how patient we are. So we are. that's why when we came back, we brought um, home remedies such as Pau de Arco, you know, that cake, that's right, that yeah. ointment. How many are the members of the team? How many? Today, phase two. Yes. Uh, ten. There are ten. ten. So actually ten of you troop to the archive center <laughs> yes. to digitize so yes. many things. So each person perhaps digitizes how many? I gave them a quota of 1,300. Per person. Per person per day. And are you able to really uh, come up uh, with that for this uh, first expectation? Week, it's understandable that it, there is still a charging, adjusting. So it's understandable that they only got 500, 600, 700, but that's okay. But I expect them for the next few weeks to increase. Mm -hmm. So I guess it takes a little while, right, to get yeah. adjusted. And with the project date of completion, you think you will be able to manage to finish that? Uh, so far, our contract is only until until October 15, so yeah. if that's October 15, I definitely cannot finish that. But uh, if we extend and black by black and white, it was already approved until December December 15, we're able to finish it. Are there veterans in the Philippines that are still living and, and, and you know, they're, they're still living there and they're expecting, well, they know about the project, I'm sure, and they're expecting some of their documents to be reproduced. Um, are you aware? Are you in touch with some? No, we're not in touch with. But uh, the Pival, office, but the office knows. is in touch with. They must be so excited about the project. Yes. I'm sure. So, well, now that you're... You are heroes by yourselves. Because, yeah, uh, you ourselves. know, heroes, yes. Digital heroes. The digital <laughs> heroes <laughs> to undertake this project. And that's why projects are not always easy. And there are challenges, and that's what makes it so important because this project is very meaningful for the country. What do you think then will the government feel as soon as they have the complete archives of the Philippine documents about the veterans? Okay, uh, particularly FIVA will be, of course, very proud. proud. This is one of their crowning uh, achievements. Yes. Uh, it's really a uh, momental, <laughs> yes, <laughs> monumental, monumental uh, achievement. And that's, that's all. We are very proud of Correct. it because um, maybe when we also get old, yeah. <laughs> our future children will recognize us because we did. We made. That's we right. Made history you made also. it happen. That's right. And for you also, for your grandparents, yeah, exactly. that now you realize the sacrifices that I have gave up for the country. Correct. 